everyone. I hope you're wintering well. I know I've talked about my brutal weather here in Upper Michigan the last three videos um, since like October. We don't even know what to do with the snow anymore. Um, but the good thing about that is I've had plenty of time to hibernate and create. So, and a little retail therapy in there too. So what's the first thing I go and buy? A pumpkin. I know, I need another pumpkin like I need a hole in the head. But this isn't just another pumpkin. This is a Fergie Lightfoot Crackle Pumpkin. If you've never heard of artist Fergie Lightfoot, check out her Facebook page or type in her name on Pinterest. You'll see her fabulous works of art. I'm so happy to have one of her sweet little pumpkins to inspire. March is here and we are counting the days that we leave for Transworld in St. Louis. We will be picking up a special prop we pre-ordered back in January from one of our favorite vendors there. I can't wait to walk through the showroom doors. I also plan on taking an early bird Bloody Mary makeup seminar, and we're going to the Vampire Ball. So I'll definitely take you along for all the highlights in my next video. Haunter's Hangout Show Season 7 has started. Watch live Wednesday nights, 9 Eastern, for your chance to win great prizes from sponsors of the show. I'll be there to ask your questions to all the awesome guests this season. So since my last video, I made a cowgirl trick-or-treater and a set of Vergie-inspired pumpkins. Two of the pumpkins were made using Dollar Tree styrofoam pumpkins covered in paper clay. And the third one was a purple organic pumpkin using paper mache. So you'll see my little bits of progress throughout this video of them, but really I'm here to show you how I made my Moonchild trick-or-treater. So let's get started. I hope you enjoyed this video, I hope to inspire, and I'll talk to you soon.
Oh, oh, oh.